This is Colton Tackett on Sonic Boom Fair One. One, welcoming you back to more of my walkthrough of the Dell Dimension 4600 running Windows XP Home Edition. And yeah, this this part of the video was sponsored by Wii Party from the Wii, released in 2010. So, oh, I've, I'm hearing this noise again. But anyway, we're gonna turn the speakers on, and we're gonna turn the computer on. Alright, like always, we have this Dell logo at the beginning of the computer startup. Oh, the Windows XP logo and startup screen. Oh, yeah, good memories. <laughs> yeah, I love Windows XP a lot. I mean, yeah, I know it's my favorite operating system and it's so freaking awesome. It's starting up. Oh, look at the key. Okay, I think I might be going off the keyboard. Right, where, do I have to put this mouse here or something? I don't know. But anyway, we're going to log on to my user. Like always. Wait, did I just click on the user or did I not? Anyway, I think the volume for the computer is like probably set. Okay, I think it is. Okay. Now let's type in the password. Okay. It's gonna take time, viewers. Oh, it's it's logging me on now. Uh, and also viewers, what well, after I was done the previous part, um, a few days ago, I had to like change myself the desktop background for this computer, just to let you know. And, um, yeah, it is pretty old whatsoever, but, yeah, you know. So, yeah, I changed the desktop background to, like, a Sonic Boom desktop background. And I'll prove to you that it's, like, pretty brand new. And I'll show you some, like, awesome updates on the Windows Media Player I have on this computer. So, yeah, it's loading my personal settings on the, uh, computer. But, I, I mean, I know that the Windows XP startup's gonna come in any second. So, it'll come there any second now. Just give it some time, viewers. I'm sure it'll be fine. Okay, we're still on the welcome... Uh, it says, welcome, Colton, loading your personal settings. We get what it says, but, um... But can't it just log me on? Seriously, I've got some things to do on this computer. Like, seriously, this is, like... It takes a long time to load. <coughs> Alright. It's been three dang minutes. Come on, dude. Give me some spare, man. Give me some spare money, dude. <laughs> Come on. Just load already. Loady, load, load, load. Come on. Come on, dude. I have the speakers on. And I know you're going to have to, like, try to put that Windows XP startup sound on. Play it, please. I know you want to do it. Just do it. Oh, Come on. Focus, dang camera. Focus, dude. Thank you. Okay. Okay. This is taking a long, long time. I don't even know what the heck. You know, just pause that for a minute. I don't know what the heck is going on. Okay, I don't know what the heck is going on, but this won't even, like, try to start up some... Okay. Uh, I mean, I do have the speakers plugged into the right cable, but the thing is that... Uh, oh. Son of a gun. Camera, Focus. Focus, 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 focus. It's your stupid blurry camera. Okay, thank you. Now I don't even know what the heck is going on with this computer, but it, it needs to, it needs to log me in. You know what? I, I'm, I'm not gonna take this anymore. Just, just do it. Log me in, you son of a gun. It's been like four minutes, and I'm, I need some. I don't need to be, like, feeling boring like this, dude. I mean, we've reached, like, the 10th freaking part already. Seriously, this is, the t this is the 10th part of this walkthrough. Just, ugh. Just log me in, dude. I know you want to do it. Oh, my. Son of a freaking gun. It won't even do it. Like, like, how long is this going to log me in for? Like, 10 minutes? 
Oh, gosh. I don't want to spend, like, a lot of freaking minutes trying to log me in like this. Jeez. I'm pausing it, dude. I'm, I'm not going to take this anymore. Okay, this is starting to tick me off. Come on, Winners XP. I know you can do better than that. I haven't been on this computer like a few days ago. It just did it. It just did it. It it did the startup sound. After a few damn minutes. Wow. Stupid Windows XP. I mean, I know I know you're still my favorite operating system, Windows XP, but why would you be so lazy to like play that startup sound after like a few minutes of waiting? <clears throat> that never happens. Oh, oh, here it is right here. There's there's the desktop background right here that I changed it like take a look at it you see that this is from one of the Sonic Boom episodes from season two it's from the Augman Out episode so yeah so yeah viewers what do you think of the desktop background should I keep it like this or should I change it again I mean I know that this desktop background looks cute but I don't even know why okay and yeah the, the taskbar is here Recycle bins here and even the icons. So okay, like always, I'm gonna I'm, we're gonna check Winners Media Play. We're gonna check on the updates of Winners Media Player to see about like what we have. And I know that we're eventually taking a look at something cool, you know, about the updates on the videos to show you that um, there's some new stuff here. Not to mention that, and you know. This new video, it's going to look really cool. But I'm not going to play it because Windows Media Player won't do good on this computer. Although, that you could still go in the application and then take a look at all the music and pictures and videos. So, click Windows Media Player. It's going to take a long time. All right. Okay. Windows Media Player. All right, it's been seven minutes, but no harm. We have eventually have done a really good job on using this computer a lot. <clears throat> Man, it's been such an this has been a this has been such an old computer these days, and I'm using like such an old computer that's been like fourteen to fifteen years old, very old computer, and I love it so much. And yeah, I know that um. This could be, I, I'm in my basement because this is this is where the computer is. It's in this basement right here. So that's why I'm using this old computer. Yeah, this basement looks really cool because I'm I'm in a basement where we know that this computer's in here. Um, it's gonna take time for Windows Media Player to load, so just give it some time. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. I had to like go to the bathroom and like wash my hands too. But now I'm back, and, um, yeah, here are some updates on how I have Windows Media Player. I mean, this picture I have gotten, like, a few days ago. I got it, I had gotten that that picture to the computer. I, it was from my tablet, and I moved it to the computer just in case I wanted a new desktop background. So, yeah. Had this, like, on 2018, which is this year. Using an old computer in 2018, and it still works a lot. And there are some other pictures I had that were from 2012. They are pretty old nowadays. Old, even these, as you could see. I remember this one, the Robin Hood. And, uh, and yeah, I already seen these. So, and did I mention that? Uh, <clears throat> I saw Sonic and Knuckles and Sonic 3D Blast for the Sega Genesis. I've played those before, and I remember them a lot. Especially Sonic the Hedgehog 2 and Sonic Spinball. Because I remember those a lot. So it's time for me to, like, you know, like switch these things right here, so... I'm going to go to videos now. now. I'm going to show you the updates. Okay, I'm going to scroll down. Now take a look right here. This is one of the videos I eventually had 
probably from YouTube, even though it was a blocked video, I found a way to download it on my tablet. By using the archive website, you know, the Wayback Machine website, to go back in time to find this video, and I downloaded it to my tablet. And I moved it to this computer so that way I could have it. So, viewers, are you happy now? And yeah, this is the Good Day Sunshine video that the Clemmer made on YouTube way back in 2006. Although it's blocked on YouTube still, I eventually am very happy that this video is good to play now. It's really good, and I'm very happy to play this. I mean, this computer is, like, pretty outdated, but it's still good. Oh, and I'll be trying to put all these songs from this album right here. The Playhouse, Disney's, Imagine, and Learn With Music. I'll be putting all this, you know, all these Freddy songs onto the, onto a thumb drive, or maybe put, move them on this, move them to the tablet. Hopefully, if it works, I'll be able to try to, like, try to test them. If they work, then I'm very glad they do. But if not, then that's terrible. So, um, yeah. And that's it. I think. Wait. The, the right mouse button is trying to stick out. Oh, God. Come on. Alright. Alright. Once again, I'm not going to shut down this computer. Wait, probably I might, but I'm not really sure. I'm going to have to, like, try to find that one part where I have to watch Microsoft Money videos. So... I'm gonna have to watch one of them for each part. Maybe, wait, it's not in the control panel, it's actually in the, oh, gosh. Oh, excuse me. All right, click my computer. Flashlight. And then, let's, let's click on, okay, it says like, the free space, 58.6 gigabytes left. Local disk C drive. Wait. Sample music right here. Okay. Uh, might actually have to click on program files. Where's Microsoft Money? Oh, there's Microsoft Money. Okay. Now I'm just gonna like try to uh, click on media. AV help. And there's the videos right here. Let me count how many there are. Okay. It's so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. There's like 11. So, since this is the 10th part, this is going to be our first. This is the, ta the, 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 the tax video. So, we're going to play this one first. So, I'm going to maximize this for a minute. I'm gonna click um, when this opens. Up. Okay. I'm not going to begin this yet. Just, just give me a minute. All right. Okay. Now let's try to click. Play. Here we go. Our taxes are going to be a snap now this that is we loud, use though. Microsoft Money. How's that? Well, let's take a look at our Money homepage. We can switch the homepage view to show just our tax information. Then at tax time, Money uses all of our financial information to help us file our taxes. So what do we do to get ready? Money can help us find any deductions we're eligible for. We just have to answer a few questions. Oh, I see. Money tells us about available deductions, medical expenses, donations, and home mortgage interest. Then it lets us know which deductions we might be able to take at tax time. Money can even help us track these deductions throughout the year. Here, money can demonstrate the tax implications of selling stocks. And I bet these links on the home page take us to the MSN Money website, where we can keep up to date on late-breaking tax news and also reference informative tax articles. They sure do. And whenever we want to find out how much we owe in taxes, we can go to the tax estimator, where money takes all our financial information, including our income and our deductions, and gives us a good sense of what our taxes will be. 
I see that we fill in some of these numbers, but money fills in the rest for us. What if we want to see the figures that money's using to do this estimate? It's easy. If we go to the tax line manager, we can review the tax line categories and their totals. Just click a category and then click go to details. Now we can see all the individual entries that made up that tax line total. Looks like we can even open an individual entry. I sure would like to know how much to withhold so we don't pay too much or too little come tax time. Well, take a look at this. If we go to the tax withholding estimator, we can find out if we are over or under withholding. I see. We just choose whether we want to get a refund or owe taxes and how much we want it to be. And then we enter our paycheck information. I see. Here, it looks like we're supposed to enter our allowances. And now, here's our result. How did money figure it so exactly? It calculated the extra amount we need to withhold on top of the normal required withholdings. So we'll come out just right. All I have to do is take this figure into my payroll department and have them adjust the withholding. If we prefer, we could set up a monthly bill to help us save more by April 15th, or update our budget to reflect an IRS refund. Our options for April 15th seem pretty straightforward. They are. With money, we'll be ready to use a tax program, file our taxes by hand, or turn our information over to an accountant. We can even file our taxes on the web. You're right, Amy. Money will definitely make it easier to get our taxes ready this year. All right, that's it. All right, that will conclude this one. Yeah, uh, manage your taxes. The second one and the next part for part 11, we'll be playing this one. Enter checks and deposits. So now it's time for us to shut down this computer. All right, let's shut her down. So we'll take time, but give it some minutes. Alright, that will conclude part 10 of my walkthrough of the Dell Dimension 4600 running Windows XP Home Edition. See you tomorrow for part, well, not really tomorrow, but next time for part 11. So we can like, take a look at the Enter Checks and Deposits tutorial for Microsoft Money. Thanks for watching. This is Colton Tackett on Sonic Boom Fan 101 signing off. Thanks for watching.